Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Today's story is D-Link Router Vulnerabilities. A security researcher named Pierre Kim, I believe he's a South Korean researcher, has released a bunch of vulnerabilities affecting the D-Link 850L uh, cloud Wi-Fi router. Apparently, this is a popular consumer routing device, which you can buy on Amazon, that just under 100,000 customers out there use. Long story short, this researcher found 10 vulnerabilities in this popular router. I won't go into any of them in any detail, but there's a big range of them. Uh, anything from cross-site scripting attacks within the web UI, things that allow you to remotely gain control of the router, uh, things like uh, easy to uh, replace firmware that allow you to load Trojan firmware, hard-coded certificates. Long story short, whether it be local network attacks or internet-based attacks, uh, the security researcher showed that you could take over these routers and kind of replace the firmware with a Trojan firmware, thus having full backdoor access. Anyways, it's not the first time consumer routers have had the vulnerabilities, nor will it be the last time. Uh, it's something that happens quite regularly, but according to this researcher, he thinks D-Link products, for whatever reason, don't have a very good security. If you'd like to know details on any of these vulnerabilities, I recommend you check out the researcher's blog post. As far as what to do, uh, I do think the researcher is reporting these, although the researcher does sometimes disclose these vulnerabilities without giving the vendor time to patch, which I don't think is very good. I think you should do responsible disclosure where you give the company time to patch. But this researcher says D-Link wasn't quick to respond in the past. Nonetheless, I'm sure D-Link will respond to this now, so if you're one of the users of this particular router, keep an eye out for the D-Link firmware update. Anyways, interesting story. Check out the researcher's blog post. That's it for today. Thank you for watching.